Hello everyone. So today we'll be discussing about the poem Ode to Nightingale. So first let's talk about John Keats the poet. He was born on 31st October 1795 and died at 23rd Feb February 1821. The poet is published less than 4 years before his death. So once is a beauty of nature is a relation between imagination and creativity. So he said a famous line which said a thing of beauty is a joy forever its loveliness increases it will never pass into nothingness so let us go into the poem now so the first stanza talks about my heart aches and a drowsy numbless pain it talks about a kind of pain or feeling that is art is feeling that is sad or happy any emotion that he is feeling my sense as through of hemlock i had drunk hemlock meaning is like a poison drink that he takes in a sensation so that is hemlock or emptied some it's a slow death so like he's comparing his present state uh with some drugged state as if his sensations are going away from him one minute passed and leet the words had sunk so the leet meaning here he's trying it is a river of forgetfulness so he's trying to forget the memories of his life which is not very good this not through envy of the happy lot but being too happy in thin happiness that though light winked dried of the trees in some melodies plot of bihage green and shadow numberless so this dried meaning means it is a supernatural creature it is like a fairy uh, in the forest so he's talking about that so the nightingale should be like a dark creature uh, i mean not a creature like a bird and it sings of the summer in full throat ease so the nightingale should be referred as a dark bird but here it tells green so in this they refer the summer it is a warm and a brightness sunlight uh, they refer this to summer but in this they are referring the nightingale with the summer so that's the interesting part in this so let us look into the second para now o oh, for a throat of vintage that hath been so he talks about the drinks he can forget about his life right in the nightingale cause that's where he wants to be so this tells about uh, how the vintage glass drink he wants to take and forget about the bad memories and stuff he had and he wants to be like the nightingale cooled and a long age in deep delvent earth tasting of flora and the country green he misses the warmth of the joy he tells a glass of wine feel so where men and women dance it is a stage where men and women dance and he feels that feel of the men and women dance and the glass of wine he wants to have and forget all the memories uh, i mean the bad memories with that glass of sip of wine and dance and provence song and sun burns myth oh for a beacon full of the warm south full of the true and blushful hypocris so hypocris meaning is like it is a horse foundation it's supposed to give a poetic uh, creativity or inspiration it beaded bubbles winking at the brim so bubbles could play a surface of the glass and the wine stained and purple stained mouth that i might drink and leave the world unseen so so the poet says that he could get drunk and forget the world so he would get drunk and forget this whole world and this memories of the bad memories and escape with the nightingale away in the dark forest so nightingales will be like in the dark forest so the poet says he wants to escape this world and and with the fade away into his forest gym and that's the end and the poet wants to fade away in the forest gym in the dark forest with the nightingale